Russian military industrial complex is being destroyed because of the war against Ukraine. People involved in the Russian military industrial complex are complaining about suffering losses. Ukraine's National Resistance Center reported this with reference to cyber resistance activists who obtained the evidence. Dmitry Fadiv, CEO of the Murum machine building plant, wrote in an email intercepted by the activists that inflation and the shortcomings of Russia's bureaucratic approach prevents plants that form the country's military industrial complex from fulfilling government orders. As chairman of the Vladimir Oblast Defense Companies League, Fadiv complained that plants are forced to sell their goods at prices set in 2019, but are at the same time expected to purchase details at market prices and in advance. Fadiv said that the money received from the government was not enough to cover the interest on the credit that his firm would need to take out to pay its suppliers. Moreover, this money is tied up until the completion of the government contracts, which normally last three to five years, meaning during this time, the money is effectively frozen. The Murum machine building plant lost 70 million rubles, approximately $770,000 in the production of the device 1T146 navigation systems alone and is now struggling to keep up with the ever-growing state demand for its devices. Fadiv also complained in the intercepted email that there is a shortage of staff at the plants due to both mass mobilization and a lack of accommodation in the area. Building barracks in the area has not helped solve the issue.